Let's add a 3D effect to the card flipping. So the perspective property is what's going to give some depth to our elements, okay? So we're going to add a 1000 pixel perspective to the memory game container and also a property that's called transform style preserve 3D to the memory card because that's what's going to insert our memory card element inside the 3D space we just created in the memory game container because otherwise the memory card is going to keep being flat sitting on the 2D plane. So back in the editor, let's add those properties. 1000 pixel perspective to memory game and transform style preserve 3D to the memory card. We still don't see the 3D effect because we have to add a transition to the transform property. And there we have it, the 3D effect. Well, when we flip the card, we should be seeing the front face, right? And uh, right now, what we are seeing is the inverted JS badge. That happens because every HTML element has a back face, which is a mirrored image of itself. Okay, there's also a property called back face visibility that defaults to visible, and this is why we are seeing the inverted badge. So the first thing you have to do is to hide the back face. And now that's hidden, we have to rotate the front face 180 degrees in the y-axis so we can see it.